I'm sure you've all seen people make planes that are only propelled forward by recoil, typically the cannons or maybe miniguns or something. But what I bet you haven't seen, or maybe you have, in which case that would be unfortunate because I thought this was original. What if I not only propelled the plane with recoil, but also replaced all the control surfaces with things like smart cannons and miniguns to actually maneuver the plane? Now, this isn't a good idea but it might it might be kind of interesting so i'm just gonna make a block of these in the back i don't really know how many i'll need making this aerodynamic is not the easiest thing but i guess i can just yeah i, I can do something like this actually here i can make it look like some sort of interesting intake like i actually intended for it to be that way like there we go see it was intentional because now it's like really cool intakes i could even add uh, oh, maybe a bit of, bit of that. Yeah, there we go. Alright, let's just see how much thrust this is. Um, I have no idea how much that's actually going to be. So let's set up some timings for these. Let's see how this is once they're all ready. That's not a lot of thrust. New idea. Uh, how, how powerful are the miniguns? Oh yeah. Oh that- oh th wait that's actually- I could kind of throttle it but I want to- I think I want to make it so I can just hold it down. Yeah that- that is much better. Uh so I think I'm gonna run with this and just make it look a little nicer. Um let's see if this works. Okay good start. Alright maybe now? There we go. Oh. It's hitting this. Okay. Uh oh wait you know what? I know how you fix that. I will use the new- where is it? Uh, the new large tape. This is... That's... That weighs 10 kilograms and is absurdly large. Maybe, maybe not. Let's just... Let's just do this. Oh. Oh, it's working. Oh, it's actually so smooth. Uh, oh, right. I have no control over this yet. But that is... That is working. Oh, something... Ah, I got hit. Okay. That's working, though. Uh, and now let's... Figure out how we get this to turn. I'm thinking we should just be able to do something like this, uh, where we get the smart cannons and just stick them below the wing. Uh, now, I have no idea how much power we're actually going to need, but let's hope this is enough. And actually, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and give them a little delay here. All right, let's see. We are barely able to move now. Um, hmm. Oh, oh, we're, we're kind of picking up speed. Okay. Oh, the roll works. And we are now, oh, right, we still have thrust under, or uh, in the water. See, this is actually better than conventional thrust. We're also hitting ourselves a little bit. I'm just not going to worry about that. We actually, oh, oh. Why am I... Okay, that's not good. All right, I'm gonna do a bit of weight reduction here because that might be one of the issues. Hmm. Not the best aerodynamics, but that's okay, I guess. I also want to make the roll more responsive. Unfortunately, that means more weight and, and worse aerodynamics there, but oh well. You know what, one thing that might actually help is just turning this into a biplane. I mean, that just always fixes things. Uh, let's see how it works. Oh, right. We still have, like, no thrust. <laughs> Maybe I can just add in some little wheels down here. Alright. Now let's go. Oh, there we go. Oh. Oh, you know what? It's it's really annoying. For some reason, when you repair, the, uh, the, like, ammo amounts are reset. Oh, look at that. We actually get some lift there. Um, I feel like we're a little front heavy. Oh, we're flying. Oh, if I use, if I hit A and D at the same time, we actually, um, go up, uh oh, that's not good, okay, well, we are flying, we, uh, we can run out of roll control because of the ammo, but, the, uh oh, they're still, okay, yeah, they're still kind of hitting, Maybe if I just ignore that problem, 
It'll go away. It is, it is not going away. I think it's because we're drifting. Like, like yawing. I, I forget what the technical term for that's called. Uh, but first, I think I want to actually add a bit more lift to this. Let's give it some uh, uh, winds around here. I think they still provide lift normally, even if they're flipped around like that. That should make things a little better. Uh, I think how I might be able to fix the issue with the guns is by rotating them around and bringing them underneath. Yeah, that that might do something. Let's see. Go. Still have no pitch. Oh, there we go. We have much more lift now. Do a barrel roll. And I'm out of roll. Okay. Uh, we actually have too much lift now, but I think that's going to be fixed when I add some weight in the back or pitch. I think... Yeah, I'll use miniguns for that. I'm going to throw in some of these. What? How did I get misaligned? Okay. Give it some wedges in the back, fake wings, and then I'll throw on the miniguns on the ends, kinda. Actually, if I get rid of those, that could work. I need two sets of these. So if I do this, set those to S, and then these to W. Let's see if that works. Okay. Okay. We, uh, we're pitching up way too much. Let's actually replace these with wings. That should actually fix, uh, fix the issue. This is looking so strange. But that should work. Oh, yeah. We have to be very careful with, uh, with everything, otherwise we'll run out of ammo. But it does work. It's not the fastest. We're no longer shooting our own thrust here uh, with all those miniguns. So moving them down actually seemed to fix it, surprisingly. Uh, pitch is down, which I think I can fix that by just taking some weight off of here. I'm just going to replace it with a fake wing. I feel like we're more just floating around, but... I mean, it's working. Oh, you can see <laughs> all the impacts on the mountains. And pillars, uh, you can see those from the, uh, the engines, if you can even call these engines. Okay, uh, for the sake of aerodynamics and my ears, I'm gonna go ahead and replace the roll control with miniguns, because it is, it is so loud, and it's just, it's kind of annoying. And we can also add more wings this way. Uh, let's see if we can move. Not really. Let's get the wheels back. Go! Yeah, oh, that is, that's a lot of control. I feel like it's kind of just hovering now. It's, it's so slow. <laughs> um, I mean, it does work. Like, I have full control. Of, oh, I lost something. Yeah, this is, uh. This is working. It looks so strange, but I mean, okay, it, it really does just kind of hover. <laughs> Why does it hover like this? What? Oh, you know what I should do? Let's disable the reticles and auto aim on all those. Um, there we go. That's much better. Okay. Um, yeah. For some reason, this thing, it really just feels more like flying a like a VTOL aircraft or a helicopter or something, because we we really don't have much thrust due to the underwhelming recoil of the miniguns. Oh, it's shooting itself again. Maybe I should imagine yaw. Um, let's see if we can land over here. Oh. Come on. It's so floaty. What is this? How do I land? What? Okay, we'll land over here. Ah, uh, okay. Never mind, I meant over here. It's backing up. What is it doing? Okay. Whoop. Ow. What? What? How did that break? Alright, well, I guess that's a successful landing. Nope. Oh. Great takeoff. Oh, and there goes a minigun. That's fine. Okay, let's just fly over. 
Uh, let me go try to land on the carrier. I'm going up again. What? How? Is it just... Lift is so weird in this game. You just add a few wings and then... Oh, that was a nice landing. And then you just start floating away. Uh, but anyway... Um, yeah, I'm definitely going to be turning down the game volume for this one. Because this is very annoying to listen to. I've had to listen to this for over half an hour. <laughs> well, I guess I wasn't listening to it for over half an hour, but it's I've had to deal with these for over anyway. Uh, yep, it's gonna take way too long to like hit anything to end the video, so I'll just like I don't know. Uh, it'll just end as soon as I face plant back onto the carrier. Here we go. We.